what is going on everybody and welcome back to the channel today we're going to go ahead and talk about some call of duty specifically the release of season six of modern warfare's warzone but before we go into any of that please do me that favor like the video subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and hit the bell for notifications in the background there's some warzone gameplay so do enjoy that as we get through the topic of discussion today that all being said let's go ahead and get into it warzone has been a huge success in my own opinion it has truly saved modern warfare i say that because modern warfare's multiplayer side is nearly unplayable it requires a level of sweat to be consistent in order to have fun and it is terrible I will not recommend that to anybody I do play it every now and again but most of the time even for me when I jump on the game I'm playing Warzone however that is a total different discussion for another day I don't want to rant so I'm gonna go ahead and get back to Warzone and its greatness when it comes to this season six for all of you out there who don't know season six of Modern Warfare's Warzone will be released on September 29th and it will come with a few new aspects that we all want love and are looking forward to first and foremost we will be getting a new battle pass one through a hundred we're gonna get a new one so look forward to that I'm gonna go ahead and be checking that out in future videos to see what we're gonna get hopefully it's better than the last one moving on though we're gonna get Nikolai and Farah as new operators and this season will mark the return of a few new iconic weapons according to the rumor mill we're gonna get the R700 sniper rifle the legendary AA-12 shotgun and the Val assault rifle obviously the new update is also going to come with weapon tweaks and balancing along with it so do be on the lookout for that next season six will be implementing a new metro system into the map there are plenty of videos concerning this throughout youtube land so if you want an in-depth review of it or the locations where potentially the stations are going to be go ahead and check all that out i ain't got time to be doing all that however i do want to provide you with some information and i do goal to keep it rather brief the system is believed to have seven stops scattered throughout the map all of the stations will have weapons armors girl scout cookies etc and will be accessible to all players they aren't that big the stations themselves are actually rather small so definitely be prepared for trap or simply noobs chilling in corners waiting to gank you and the crew so definitely when you're going in there be prepared for a fight because definitely upon release everybody and their mother is going to be there waiting for you there are ladders within the stations for quick access and quick escape so definitely be on the lookout for those as well the trains themselves will serve as a true safe space the only true actual safe space when it comes to war zone because no fighting will be allowed on the trains if the train system detects any kind of fighting the train will not move from the station and or will not even stop at said station until said fight has ceased overall the metro system will be serving as the fast travel system within the war zone it will not let you go into any stations located already within the gas and the tracks are basically going to be insta death so all of you out there who want to break the game and jump on the track and shoot at the train as it's leaving yeah you will be dead and you won't be able to be revived good luck with that have fun with that noobtastic asshole overall it seems like a cool system and i am looking forward to seeing it in action Furthermore, it has been rumored that a new game type will also be added to Warzone this season. Specifically, one that finally integrates zombies back into the game. My wonderful data miners out there, aka the true versions, have found data files associated with the mode. According to them, instead of going to the gulag upon death in this game mode, you'll simply spawn back into the map as a revenge-seeking, brain-eating zombie. Obviously, take all of this was a grain of salt because you already know it hasn't been officially released so look out for that and any kind of notifications for that through official channels i will say this would be dope and consistent with the return of zombies associated with black ops cold war so most likely they're right and we're going to get something consistent with this down the road again the new update will be released on september 29th so we don't actually have to wait that long regarding what we're actually going to get specifically 
actually seeing what we're gonna get. So at least we don't have to wait that long before we actually know. But that's about it for me. What do you all think about the new season's release? Let me know down in the comments section below. That being said, thank you guys so much for taking the time to watch my video. Please do help me out with a like on this video. If you haven't already, definitely subscribe to the channel and hit the bell for notifications of new uploads down the road. I appreciate you all and we'll definitely see you on the next one.